Hey, it's day 17 of Easter. Um, and so typical, I'm like in the one room where I can still hear my son eating cereal, but um, I get him in it. Um, so today, Tuesday, is podcast release day. And I'm very excited because today is a really fun one. It is with Glennon Doyle. And we had a conversation that I feel like I've been waiting to have for a really long time. Um, I remember seeing her uh, when I was very, very sick and she did this lovely thing where she gave everyone a hug in the audience, um, right? Like before she gave her talk and I would like, I just have photos of me in my yoga pants I wore for a million years, like super, super puffy from chemo, just like clinging to her like a life raft. And, uh, I remember her saying things like, um, uh, first the pain and then the rising. And I remember thinking that we were going to have a really good conversation about that because she's gone through so many different evolutions in her uh, life. And there was this like part of the differentiation between like, what is the pain that happens to you? Like a pandemic or losing a parent and not being able to be there or like an illness, like the stuff that happens. And then what is the pain that you, I don't like the word choose, but like have some relationship with, <laughs> have like a participation with. And so we have this like, anyway, it's really fun because we got to get into like, what is the difference um, between uh, like, are all, is all pain created equal? Um, Cause theologically, sorry, this is just like my, uh, Christian history professor aside, but theologically Christians believe that only one kind of pain is redemptive, right? Jesus's pain, like on the cross, that the work that Jesus does is like that, that Jesus is suffering, um, changes something about our, uh, our own relationship to, uh, God and to the world and to our brokenness. But like, is our pain redemptive? I'd like to think that I mean, spiritually, no, never. <laughs> it's not ever. Actually, only Jesus' pain is redemptive. <laughs> I almost got confused there for a minute. Uh, but that's not to say, though, that we don't change and grow and have and like and have a transformative experience through pain. Like I know that um, I profoundly resent anyone who tells me that I uh, that cancer was a gift. Like, thanks, John Piper. He had a whole book called like, don't waste your cancer. And uh, I had a lot of, uh, a lot of thoughts about that at the time and in the present. <laughs> um, but I have still, so even though cancer is not a lesson and pain isn't, uh, designed by God to be a lesson, uh, that we still learn things. And so like the difference between lesson and learn is is one of the really fun things we get to talk about. So Glennon is a gift and uh, I'm just really excited about this episode. So anyway, I hope you download it uh, wherever you get your podcast. I don't know where that is. It's not entirely clear to me how the internet works. So, okay. I hope you have a beautiful, terrible Tuesday of Easter. Bye.